It started. We did it, guys. It's actually doing it. This oh, we live. No way. Oh, we live. Oh, sweet. Hi, everybody. No way. We're gonna do. Hi, everybody. We're gonna do uh, the second year project, basically, just to show how we do it yep. and to show the the high poly kind of workflow with ZBrush and Bacon and all that. Sorry, I'm kind of ill, so I'm dying here. Don't put yourself down, Chris. Oh, yeah. Don't put yourself down. You're not. You're not ill. Don't. Don't, don't give in. To There's it. tissues everywhere. <laughs> it's not. It's not good. You're not ill. Uh, you're the illest. Am I screen sharing? I am. I'll say hello okay. on the chat. Hello. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a centrigum real quick, and then. <laughs> Show you poly, how to get it to ZBrush, how to sculpt it, how to get it high poly, and how to get it out of it. Something I made earlier. Did you? What? No, no you didn't. You're a liar. Thank you. you have some stuff to to, to show about high poly baking, or? Oh, I can hear myself. <laughs> oh, no. That's never good, is it? Okay, so. Yeah, you want to. Uh... The video if you got it up. Yeah, I did it. I always make that mistake. <laughs> so, what are you guys doing then? I just remembered Max, you didn't do the theme tune. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Yay. Welcome to Get Good. Get Good and High Party. Why is no one high partying? Why is it? Why is it all wrong? It's forgotten how to play the melee. Yeah. Hear me then? Or is it? We can hear you, Max. Yeah. yeah. We can hear you. I'm keeping this bit bright pink. I love it. <laughs> Just really, okay. really quick yeah. modeling because meh. It's just to get, uh, show the workflow, not the. Yeah, I'm not trying to show the modeling. <laughs> product, yeah. But I still want a cool shape. Hmm. Did that go through? What the heck? Oh, of course, because it's offsided. Lopsided. <laughs> Oh my god, let's look at this. It's the pink, I can't see the red lines on it. <laughs> it runs uh, Christmas shopping. Christmas, Christmas it's, shopping. Uh, too busy. Yeah. Getting Christmas jumpers. Oh, man, oh, man. I need to get Christmas stuff. The Christmas jumper game big this year. Oh, Max, you probably haven't seen. We, uh, we started a Christmas jumper call. <sighs> All of it, we all got a uh, same jumper. It's a terrible image of a silhouette of a ski man looking out into the horizon. It's beautiful. Oh, I'm missing you. Yeah. <laughs> so I think uh, I think uh, Kieran's going out to start a rival cult with his table. So oh wait, so little, this is the cult uh, made from what I'm guessing Joel and the gang or. It's uh, me, Joel, Carl, and Christy. We'll have the same jumper. <laughs> <laughs> the same, the exact same one. Exact same one. <laughs> one from so you look like we're in a cult. <laughs> You're in a yakko. You're in a little yakko. Boy, oh, yeah. sounds good. Yeah, boy. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. You know uh, that really bad Christmas film, but you always watch it, The Snowman, with the snowman in it, and it's like... We're yeah. Watching. Yeah, I showed that to some Americans. They, they didn't understand it because it's got a sad ending. They were like, so yeah. is it going to be like Frosty because it's like a snowman comes to life? I was like, yeah, yeah it's kind of like that, but better. It's just really <laughs> And they're like, oh yeah, cool, cool, cool. 
didn't understand it. One of them thought it was in Russia. <laughs> that's, my, that's my story. This model was really bad. <laughs> that's beautiful. But no one will know. It's unrealistic, so I can't see anything. There we go. So this is the boring bit. It's pretty. So it's loads of random modeling in Max. Mm. I can't really teach you this. You just got to use Max and <laughs> get modeling. Learn Max. Yeah. It's the only way you get quicker at it, really. Yeah. You could say it's the only way you get good. Um, it's the only way you can get good at it. Oh. You got a sham for everything. That's the law. For high poly, yeah. Yeah. Basically, we're doing this. We're not going to lie because we've seen some. Should, should I say or should I not say? Yeah, whatever. Yeah. We've seen some nice projects um, done by some of uh, some of the Century Gun projects, and we've noticed that. Uh, when people are posting up their high polys, they're not actually like high poly in the sense of they're like what you would be good for baking. Yeah, they may have like a high try count, but you've not spent those tries in the correct place. Um, there's lots mm. of people who are doing like I don't know. It looks like maybe cloth simulations or something on one part, but then the the rest of the hard surface stuff isn't high poly in any way. Yeah, it's still really low poly. And when you mean when we mean high poly, it's to make everything rounded out and sort of more more real. Because when you have like a corner in real life, it's not um, it's not like a perfect edge that you get with like two polygons. Mm. It's it's like chamfered a lot. Like you touch the side of like a table, it's not it's never actually sharp. It's really rounded. And doing like that high poly is you're supposed to chamfer these corners out, make it. Like something, yeah. So it's 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 a new thing, and then you bake it on, and it rounds out the model. Makes Pretty it. much, yeah. Yep. Yeah. That's like, what we're going for, really. So yeah, I mean, is there any examples that we could probably load up and show up? All the you high can, to low. You can go low through um, modeling. <laughs> uh, modeling at the moment, Mike. Do you wanna? Um, well, yeah, I, I got uh, Scott Homer's baking stuff ready. I can go through that a little bit if you want. Show us your bacon. Show us your Kevin. You two aren't sharing screens, by the way. <laughs> I'll just ah, I Why not? Share screen now. Max is now. Oh, am I screen sharing? No. No? <laughs> no. <laughs> it says you are screen sharing. I don't know what else to do. I clicked oh. on your face. It's all black. There we go. I can see you now. Am I there? Okay. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is a good thing. Good tutorial. Kit uh, kind of showed us all this. And it's kind of become like the Bible. Um, <laughs> Uh, high to low it's poly baking. Well. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> um, this is a good example of it. This yeah. Here, uh, so this is the high poly. For this thing. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's awesome. This is his low poly, and then this is the baked version. So this would be this, but with this information. Um, we've gone over this a lot of times. Most of you know this, but basically, what we're trying to—the point we're trying to get in—is that the high poly. A lot of the sentry types we've seen is kind of this, but then maybe these these like round bits here you've made really high, but the rest is still very low. And what you want is all of this. Um, yeah, this is uh, really helpful stuff. He's mo it's mostly a tutorial on how to specifically make the book, but the, all the theory is there and it's awesome. Um, yeah, I think this goes into about like the uh, rounding off edges. So everything on like uh, 
basically nothing in real life has a perfect sharp edge, uh, which is you, what, what you get in Max basically on your low poly is, is like this mathematically perfect sharp edge, but that will never yeah. exist in real life. No matter how much you sharpen something, you try and get it to that point, that will never happen. So uh, you, you want to chamfer everything basically. You get that. Um, what else? Uh, I'd say just have a read through this. I mean, mm. me summarizing it isn't going to be as helpful as uh, just going for it yourselves. Um, low poly theory is really good. Basically, talks about uh, with your low poly, it's all about the silhouette. With your high yeah. poly, it's about the information. Um, also, with high poly baking, which I imagine a lot of the uh, um, a lot of the uh, sentry guns are, they'll um, they're normally hard surface, so. You want to think about breaking up your UV islands at about a 45 degree angle. That would give you like the best kind of bake. Um, yeah, that's, I guess that's kind of the theory behind a lot of this. Um, our main point is just make your high polys high, yo. Meant to be high. So yeah. Yeah, get that, get that dingy do that, get that stuff rounded out. Yeah. It's like you're trying to model with clay, and mm. clay is infinite in polygons and atoms and whatnot. And then mm. zebrish equivalent to that is your poly count. So just make it as high as you want until it blows up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You can be as high as you want with this with the high poly. The only thing that limits you is time. With that. Mm. That's it. Yeah. Not. And I don't know, maybe if you go crazy, crazy, maybe CP, you know, how your computer can handle it. Yeah. Don't break it too much, but see how much you can break my, uh, before you break it. Well, my PC broke a little earlier today, so <laughs> really need to update that. I think as long as I've known you, that PC has been breaking, though. You know? Yep. <laughs> as long as I've known you, you've been like, oh, my PC's going to break any time. <laughs> we can finally have it. I think it's done pretty well. To be honest. Yeah. I, I, I run them to the ground. <laughs> that. Uh, yeah, I, I don't to I'm not I'm not the uh, biggest expert on high to low poly making for like in Max because I mostly do characters now. I've only known it from like my workflow would be I'd create the high poly first. So I'd uh, <clears throat> mock that up in ZBrush and then retopologize it down. So you don't, I almost, I almost like, I forget that this is a thing that you have to worry about how high your high poly is, because mine's just ridiculous, because it's come straight from ZBrush, and it'll be like 10 million mm. try, or 10 million polygons, so even double that for the tries. <laughs> Going back into it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like your high poly is fucking high. How's the, uh, the old century game coming along? It sure is, Max. Max, you're not Max, you're Mike. Come on, Max. Come on, Max. You got the same M at the start. Oh, that's the excuse. Don't, don't become Pat. <laughs> oh. Too many M's. <laughs> Need feet on this thing before I can actually. Do anything to it. Let's just clip that in there. Oh, that was pretty good. Okay. Hell, am I making? I sure am. You sure are. If I hit the Windows key instead of Shift and Alt, that's annoying. <laughs> you guys uh, got any plans for Christmas then? Got any uh, 
Yeah, presents. Get yeah, yeah, money. Get money. Get paid. <laughs> I don't know, actually. How did I just hit... I thought I hit symmetry and I hit display smash. Um, Christmas, I don't know. I need to get presents yet. Yeah, I need to buy presents for the family. That's what I need to do. Mm, same. It's getting quite late. Mm, indeed. We finished so late, actually. Yeah. I don't know, we don't really do back. anything, do we? No. It's like we've got Monday. Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm starting a personal project. I'm making uh, Canada from Akira. It's going to be my Christmas project. Canada, the country. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the country. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, man. High poly. <laughs> it's very high poly. All of Canada. Chris, you might want to uh, change back to your off screen. I am. That is it? Yeah. Oh, I thought I was watching the video. That was it. Oh, it is. <laughs> Take it back. Take what it. you like? What am I like? Like a lion. Um, uh, can you like believe it? Oh, my. Oh, my days. Yeah, I think I'm only going back for a week. So I'll probably be back. I'm going to be back here for New Year's. I'm not sure if I'm going to that one. Yeah, coming back, coming back for New Year's. No surprises yeah. this time. What about you, Chris? What's, are, you, are you coming down? Are you coming back from Germany, Chris? Coming down where? You know, down, down back <laughs> to uh, the old England. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, from my native country of, um, I don't know, Iceland. Yeah, I'll come back. <laughs> That's what happens after flying for lectures. <laughs> we have a seminar on after just get a plane. Fly <laughs> it's quite amazing that you're so committed to the course, to be honest. I mean, the money you must be spending. Oh. This commutes, man. Yeah, it's fine. It's the YouTube money. <laughs> now it needs feet. We get it. Yeah. I'm not sure if I'll actually unwrap this. I think I'll just make a low poly and a high poly version of it. So I can say like, I oh, see, look, this is right, this is wrong. You make one two maps. But even then, oh, I like it. Yeah, got my, got something starting here. It's got his little skis. It's got little skis. <laughs> I thought Christmas themed. <laughs> How got <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you got to commit to the Christmas, you know. You do. Oof. What's going on with that? Just rushing this now. <laughs> yeah, same. I mean, yeah, you're doing it now, it's always going to be a rush job. <laughs> <laughs> kind of unavoidable. Do you want to load up, I don't know, maybe some examples on our station of good high poly stuff, Mike? Whilst we're... I can have a look, yeah. And then also, I don't know, maybe some, like, find anything on our station or something like some bad examples, if that's possible. I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll search around and then I'll, I'll get back to you with that. I'll find some stuff. Right back to you, Max. Bring it all back to you. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm bored of that now, so that'll be. Yeah, uh, it's actually, actually.
do 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 It's not attaching anyway, <laughs> the legs. <laughs> Lol. Ta da! Shooty man. Good. Bought it. Gun thing. Yeah. I think I set mine to one application, not the whole screen. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I need ZBrush now. Where is it? Do, 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 do. Reckon Tor Frick will have some good hype. Huh? Yeah, he probably would. Old Tory. See Rush. I'm in. I did it. And then divide and then just divide. Us. Me basically open ZBrush, hit document, hit new document, saying no, you've got full screen. Hit import in the top right. Find your mesh. Uh, spend five minutes thinking what you call with it. Um, gun. Yes. Open up. It's there on the side. Click and drag. If you hold shift at the end whilst you're dragging it, it sets it to the axis. And then make sure you hit edit or T, otherwise you can't do anything. You just keep drawing them out. Which is quite fun, you can do that. If he wants to do that. I think I might do my high point. When you click on the outside to rotate, you hold Alt and click to pan. And then I think you hold Alt and then right click here, and then you let you go Alt to zoom in. Mm. Go down there and hit perspective if you want. You can turn it off. You can put a floor in. You can hit that one to render it. All these things don't really matter. There's the polyframe. It's the same. And all we want to do is sculpt onto this. So go to geometry. And then should I divide it? Yeah, I'll divide it. I'm going to divide it. And all when right. you divide it normally. Well, I divide it a few times. Yeah, what when you divide it normally like that, it will smooth it as mm. well. You don't want that. So, uh, Smooth off. You do like two or three without and then like a few with. And that's what the polyframe does then. Which is not really that ideal that's still. Fun. No, yeah. You could probably get away with uh Dynamesh in it. If you put it really high. Dynamesh quads the mesh, basically. Mm. And explain what the issue you'd have is so if you're trying to find it more it's a, trying to sculpt some detail into this geometry is a bit weird yeah and it will go into like weird triangles at some point because mm -hmm. what you're sculpting onto isn't good in the first place it's the dynamesh and then everything is all even Obviously, you want it a bit higher than that. Yeah, the only problem I have with Dynamesh for hard surface is it can ruin it. <laughs> yeah, it does. You can blob out all your, your nice, nice corners and shit. Ta da! 
that's not too bad. Everything's mm. quoted really mm. nicely. But it's all mm. even as heck. And then it's a matter of your favourite brush. I like clay build up. Plug in your tablet in. And then it works like Photoshop kind of. Uh, you just use the open and close brackets to brush size. You click and drag to add geometry like that, or to pull it out. Hold Alt and click to bring it in. And then Shift is to smooth it. The higher it is, the less effective this is going to be. I might undo the dynamation and then just bring it down a bit more. That's better already. Oh yeah, we started at um, 3 o'clock today, didn't we? Yeah. So like we were talking about edges and things, smooth it all off. Actually, I'll put some mm -hmm. as well. Which way do I want it? There we go. So that's literally holding shift. And then when you bake that onto the low poly, it will look way more nicer. Way, way nicer. So smooth it, add geometry, and then you have to think about surface details that you want. Let's see if this works. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> These can be like little details that you'd bake in a manolas. Pretty much all there actually is to it. High poly is for detail, that's the whole point of it. And then it's hard surface, so you probably wouldn't do it, but you could you could do surface detail. Like you could dent it and stuff. Put big holes into it. Let's 
crashes into it, anything you want. And you see how it isn't very clear. A little scratch. And you have to look the geometry from there. You can send Dynamesh off and then just divide it. And then it's like really high. Mm -hmm. Just think about edges all the time. If this was real, where would it break and where and all that good stuff? it holds. Literally just play around with it. Give you some character. Oh yeah, what materials do you use? Mike? Materials do I use? Yeah, because you always tell me that this one's useless. Uh, yeah, I hate that one. <laughs> uh, normally the matte cap, matte cap grey. Yeah. It is the one that gives like the best lighting. I used to have like a downloaded one, um, which was good for like stylized stuff because it like really highlights the indents. Okay. Um, yeah, but mainly just this one. And if I'm uh, painting, like poly painting, I normally throw it on like a skin shader, so that uh, it's almost just like flat. Yeah. Ooh. Well, like there's quite a nice shiny. light light one. The metal ones are really cool, though. Yeah. This one looks like Sculpey. That one's nice, yeah. I think there's one literally in there that's called like Sculpey. <laughs> yeah, um, it's like an RNG one. I was already on it. <laughs> I was on <at> it. <laughs> yeah. few more dents in then I'll get it to low poly again. And you don't always have to re apologize by the way. No. From you your really high poly, just poly because and you haven't really yeah. changed the the shape, the basic shape. You don't have to bother. I just read to apologize because I, I never make the look poly at the start. <laughs> <laughs> I probably should. Same. I was looking at uh, some other character art guys' workflows, and they uh, they would work from like a low poly base, and like they'd sculpt on like the subdivision three, and then always like quickly go down to the low one and like move verts, and then go back up to like the three, and then they'd go to like yeah. six for like fine detail. So they wouldn't even like touch dynamesh and stuff. So I might have a try at that like. Uh, Kind of style. I mean, you have to have like a really clean base mesh, though. 
So I don't know how good I'd be at that. I have to get practice that. How's your uh, turret coming along, Max? Just about to put the lenses in, and then I'll be making, starting to make the high poly of it. So Very nice. Something like that. Pretty dodgy and rushed, but what do you expect? Smooth this off a bit, and then I'm going to re apologize it. Trick, you know earlier you mentioned about... Um, you fight a map it, Chris, when you did your turret. I was going to say, like, that's a good... good I will, speed. yeah, in a minute. Yeah, because, like, Kieran's always going on about that, but you can set it to, like, 45 uh, degree angle change, and you know, as you mentioned earlier, Mike, that's the magic mm. number for yep. normals. So uh, Kip just said in the comments, change the material, so <laughs> it's a good <laughs> thing you did that. <laughs> Hello. No one likes that one. Yeah, well, it, just, it. It, uh, it doesn't like it doesn't represent the lighting. No, it doesn't. No, so it's... I just feel like I'm used to it. That's all. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to smooth this out and then retop of it. Show you what the normals do. The point isn't it with the high poly, it's just normals, that's what you want. Mm. Generally. Really rushing in this now. What the fuck? You break it, Max. Yeah, I have. <laughs> Oh. Uh. I'll just fix it up. Don't know what to hide it there. Spend more time on sculpting than I do. Is so quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just holding shift and like spinning my brush around, my pen around. Um, button. Hi. So we have the hi. What 
would Zerum actually do to this? Let's have a look. Because I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Probably make it look gross. It's just kind of look gross. <laughs> Oh no, I'm scared. <laughs> I think I broke it. <laughs> it did it all right, but that's because it's still really high poly. <laughs> Yeah. What's their budget? I don't know. Probably, oh, I probably should have checked that. Yep. Is it twenty eight K? I think it's it's pretty low. <laughs> Is it twenty eight K low? Mm -hmm. mm, no. I'll knock it down. <laughs> probably less than twenty eight. 7,500, okay. Uh, 7,500. <laughs> That's not what you need, alright. <laughs> mm -hmm. I imagine with the, uh, the brief... Do they even go into a uh, ZBrush? Might not be allowed to. I mean, we were always told. Yeah, to use yeah they are. They're allowed to. ZBrush. Um, <laughs> but ZBrush can be great for like the uh, those kind of micro details, and scratches and dents and stuff. But you can get like a huge proportion, if not all, if you're high poly done in Max as well. I know that's how uh, a lot of people I know who uh, do high surface work. Joel primarily. Uh, works just in Max with all his high polys. He gets really awesome results. I've never seen that before. But this is a very rushed version of it anyway. Hence the Z remesher. One click. <laughs> One yeah. click does plenty. I said like one million, so it's taken a while. In my rush, should state, I think I might have. Yeah, gross. I'd just use your old low poly, man. <laughs> oh, God, what did it do? <laughs> it looks like a like... I just did the War of the Worlds like project. Flash dragged over metal. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna use the other one. Looks like oh, God. Yeah, that one's yeah, fine. Yeah, I just use your low poly. Your low poly looked good anyway. Much nicer. Uh, I need my desktop. I can't find it, so I have to go in the Explorer. So you've got a uh, Borderlands Two on your uh, dashboard there. That's What's true. That all about? Just some, uh... <laughs> Me and Max like to play it, don't we, Max? We like a bit of it. Borderlands. We should probably buy it on PC. I bet it's probably pretty. Yeah, the BL. Yeah. Pretty good. BL Lounge. Oh, PK Lounge. Did I export that or did I just save it? I can't remember. Do you guys still have delicious days? I uh, wasn't paying attention to probably be honest. Uh, yes, we do. Yeah, we still have delicious days. Delicious days. I've been getting the soup from there recently. It's really good. Yeah? I'd recommend the soup. <laughs> but what about the cheese? Get some cheese in there. You can't have cheese on your soup. Yeah, you just grate, grate a bit of cheese on top. Unless you have cheese soup. Oh, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now let's find it. 
open. Hi. It's 80 megabytes, what I've just made. <laughs> okay. Calm down. That's high poly, guys. There you go. <laughs> That's what we meant when we said it's not high poly. <laughs> it's higher poly. Basically, a high poly is going to be working crazy. I mean, I think Joe explained it best on that post where he showed his uh, his his uh, gun and like all the little grooves on his like handle. Yeah. They were all like modeled in. Stuff like that. And that's how you get the best results. When you're high poly, it's a high poly. Didn't do it. <laughs> oh, Max, I see you doing some uh, some tasty chamfering there. Yeah, just trying to get this. Ooh. Mm. Mm. I'll do this top bit properly. And I won't do the rest. <laughs> oh. I went wrong there. Oh. It's wrong. Shamper. That didn't help. I'm just playing all up and everything. Don't tell anyone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is how we do it. This is how we do it. Never know. This is how we do it. It's how we do it. That one wants someone to do it. Okay. Do you remember, like, when you're a kid, and it was Christmas no. time, there was really bad DFS adverts? Yeah. <laughs> Man, they're the best. <laughs> That's the true meaning of Christmas about it, the Yeah, please. Like more, more, more. How'd you get a good flattened map? What should my settings be? You get like Stakes. a mallet and just smack it. Where's Kieran buying jumpers? Hey, Kieran. Some problems with this. Oh, well. Forget it. I'm 
I'm going to hit OK, and then it does just some bad things. <laughs> oh dear, have you uh, reset X1? No. Let me do that. Will it fix all my problems now? That's what I find. All your problems will be solved. It did actually. <laughs> yeah. Always reset X form. I found out the other day you should uh, reset X form when you're like symmetry and stuff. Yeah, yeah, that always goes wrong. Didn't know that. I think it's like it's never gone wrong for me. Maybe no. I do it. Maybe I do it without knowing. Maybe I just. Maybe I, maybe I do it without reset. I should have made a folder for these. Basically, you reset X form after everything. Boom, okay. He's marmoset. Hapali, Hapali, Hapali. Let's get normals really quickly. Let's quickly bake those out. Quick, quick. The occlusion, sure, why not? No map. 10.24. Yeah? <laughs> that don't want to take too long. Should be alright. The occlusion might. So I'll just she's normal. I'll put it on. Whoa, you can go really high now on this. I didn't know that. Let's put it on that oh, one. Okay, yeah. How low can you go? How high can you go? How high can you go? How high can you? How much pie can you eat? Eat this much. We can't see you. <laughs> That's baking as quick as I can do it. Hi, can you throw? Yeah, don't sculpt for ten minutes and don't flatten map it. <laughs> Unwrap yeah, it with nice UVs so it doesn't have to be 4K. <laughs> Yeah, look at all the dirty cheats. Dirty, dirty cheats. Dirty cheats for meats. <sighs> it's Karen's cheat. Yeah. Well, Karen's cheat is he'll uh, flatten up it and he'll put it into substance <laughs> and just texture yeah. over all the seams. <laughs> So, are you uh, ready to pitch your idea tomorrow, Chris? Or on Tuesday? Yeah. I'm happy, man. Have you got your stuff prepared? No. Have <laughs> I? Myself. I'm prepared, but I don't have a presentation yet. No. Mine's quite late yeah. tomorrow, so yeah, I'll do it in the day. Yeah. What, what are you going for? I know you're making a character. I'm hmm? thinking. I was, I was talking to Castella and he actually had the idea but I was making like a uh, like an indie or like grunge kind of band but all the all the characters are oh, aliens. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all like these crazy looking aliens that just come in. And uh, Castella was really liking it, so. 
going to go for that. I'm going to set up some key images and get a good pitch going. Hopefully that should shut down. Hopefully. <laughs> Yeah, Max, that's a nice high quality you got going there. Hmm? What? Nice high quality you got going. Jeez, yeah, you got this. It's working. It's shot for everything, man. Shot for everything. There's no straight edges. You don't want any straight edges. No round. So, yeah, what Max is doing now is is a good idea because mm. you see how the edges didn't work because they weren't chamfered in the first place yeah they just look really weird that's, uh, I'd but then other parts that are chamfered work a lot better the best, the best workflow I'd say is uh, combine the two so you, yeah, you might want to do like scratches together. and stuff in ZBrush I think yeah. that's a nice thing to, to put in and say like you're doing some wires or something like that that'd be really cool to do in ZBrush, but like just rounding out those edges you can it's yeah, it's a lot easier in uh, obviously I, I have been guilty of just being a bit of a cheat and just uh, throwing it to the brush and yeah. at the moment I didn't like. <laughs> I'm leaving lots of end guns and stuff but I don't really have time to like yeah, yeah, yeah. sort it all out, make it look foof, 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 but so apologize to any people who know this is going Looking silly, how I'm doing it, but I'm, I'm, I'm on a time limit here, guys. <laughs> time limit. It's all about the time limit. Now I'm baking everything and texturing it really quickly. I'm not gonna lie, Chris. That looks really gross. <laughs> it's awful. <laughs> I need to see now. <laughs> it looks like I think you should uh, texture it like a cheese. Like cheese. <laughs> yeah. It looks like a tasty cheese. Cheese is a kind of meat. So the, uh, Jesus. Meat. There we go. There we go. Now we know. Oh, some high poly. It's so high. You're so high, that's a poly. Police, police. <laughs> I'm gonna call the high police. What? Don't do it. Yeah. Not do you get it? Boom, 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 chamfer town. Boom, 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 I'm chamfering around. Boom, boom, boom. It's yellow. So very yellow. Mm. Yeah, make it gold. <laughs> oh, not the bridge. What am I chatting about? you got to be careful when chamfering because you might want to keep, say, like a flat edge in between. So like when I'm chamfering this, I want to make sure it's not like too much and that it just looks rounded now because I still want it to have like a flat mm -hmm. sort of head. So it, just, it still looks like there's a, a sort of squared out manufactured look to this camera yeah. and holder thing. So just a little tip. Oh, oh. 
I don't know why I'm masking this actually, that makes no sense. Oh. It should all be gold. The hour mark. We're at the hour mark, but I'm pretty much. Ooh, maybe not. Oops, I've got some things. Hmm. Hmm. Owen boy, Owen boy, Owen boy, Owen boy. What's going on here? Ah, fuck. Should have thought of that. Oh well. Did you break it? No, I just. Rushing. Only fools. Russian, but I can't help. Russian in, Russian in. The song by me. It's pretty good, Max. I try, I try. Oh, oh, no, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Lol. I'm just texturing it, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Messing around. No, that's what I'm wrong. Can go back that far? Probably not. No. And you make an easy mistake, and you fuck it all up. <laughs> Game art. Uh, no, I'll do. It's cheeky, but I'm gonna have to do it. I love this program so much. <laughs> it's so useful.
is mine, so other than that. Program you can't run this? Substance. Oh. Oh, it's Not overly really difficult either. I love it. Oh, crashed Max. No, I haven't. Did you break it? Spaghetti. Just do that one. Oh, I finished my uh, sketchbook. My sketchbook will be a year down. Nice, man. I've not drawn for a year. <laughs> yeah. Chris isn't drawn for a year. Chris is in trouble. I knew him. Okay. Maybe if I do it like this. I don't want to go in big top. Oh. I love it when the come big pop. Do we uh, do we get laughter on next time? Next term, I don't know. People might character arts is early. That's me. That's what about uh, what about other people? What about like concert I don't know. You think they need it? Yep, I think everybody needs it. <laughs> yeah. Get it. You done did it. Yeah, keep on making silly mistakes. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for a poop? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for a poop? Bad boys, bad boys.
Well, Chris, you've made a gun. That's <laughs> again. You've done made it. Let's get in there. What was I going to put on it? Oh, yeah. I remember. That one, that looks fun. If it doesn't crash, nope. Any comments on YouTube? Crits and comments. Nope. <laughs> yeah. So there's only three people watching, it's probably us. Great. <laughs> you want our life? No pressure then, you know? We're, uh, it is because it's a clear left We're pretty far over the time. Okay, hang on. I'm, I'm, I'm done. Hang on. Matt just asked if any of us are in labs today, but it's Sunday. Who's Matt? <laughs> Matt I Uh <laughs> I'm I'm in labs. Max is always in labs. Can't get him out. He never leaves. Some say he was born there. Some say he died there and still haunts to this day. <laughs> this spoopy day. The ghost of what? game art. What? 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 There we go. That's some sort of high-ish, poly-ish thing. Oh, shit! I'll leave them do that. Oh, no, did I? I couldn't have. No, I'm not that stupid. Oh, I am that stupid. Apparently I collapsed the fucking turbo speed. I'm really dumb. Sounds like you fucked it. Yeah, I really yeah. did. Wow. Yeah, don't ever collapse a turbo smooth, otherwise you end up with this shit if you forgot something. Fucking hell. Wow, I can't believe that. I can. Oh. <laughs> Just going to steal a bit from one of these low poly. And that's why you save in iterations. Oops. Something like this, you can just go pull up. I hand paint the rest of these scratches. <laughs> Redo that whole poly then. Let's get it right. Let's get it right this time, yo. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm saying? You ready for this? I would have been done, but I'm not. I haven't made that copy. I've been doing hand painted for like the past week, exclusively. It's so fun, isn't it? I'm just like, I'm just hand painting this now. <laughs> <laughs>
It's the funniest thing ever. I'm going to make a Scratches Generator. Um, I'll do Donkey. I'll do Pig. I'll do Pig. I'll do... We're running uh, pretty far over time. Hang on, hang, hang on, on, my Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm going to put this in my set and then that'll do. How's it coming, Max? Let's we'll see. What's the old app? I made a, a simple mistake. A uh, fucking everyman dingus malingus mistake. I want to re... Fix it. I want to fix it, Mike. I have to say... Yeah, I really like your model there. Hmm? It's a nice model. Yeah, lots wrong with it. It's rushed as a bush baby. But rushed as a... <laughs> something. To do it to be good, you know, for the kids. For the kids. It looks like Star Wars. For the kids. Nah. No. I don't want to play it right now. Gosh, all the time. Three Star Wars is coming out soon. Who's yeah, yeah boy. Still haven't got tickets. I've got my tickets booked. I'm watching it. We can watch it when I'm back as well. I'll do that. This looks so bad. Star Wars. No, <laughs> the skin. <laughs> Star Wars looks fucking shit, mate. Yeah, shitty VFX. They're not even like. There's lots of puppets in it or some shit, man. Where's the CG? Where's the CG Jar Jar? Where's Jar Jar gone, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no. No more Jar Jar. Where's, where's my bro? Where's my representative of the Senate, you know? Manipulated by the Chancellor. Where's my where's my favourite Gungan? He's gone. Never I'd fire me if I made this. You'd what? You'd fire him? <laughs> I'd fire me if I made this. You made Jar Jar. If you handed this in. <laughs> if I handed this in, I'd kill myself. <laughs> Oh, I'd burn my computer. Don't make this. Is it cheesy? I haven't seen it in a while. It's, too busy. it's pretty cheesy. It's just really bad. <laughs> so it's the cheesy dream, or is it a sneeze? Cheesy dream yes. coming. Coming through. Coming up to uh, an hour and a half now. I got rid of it. I'm, I'm nearly there, Mike. Just trust me, bro. 
I believe in you, Max. <laughs> Oh, they're very smooth. Quite a lot of smooth. There you go. Oh, it crashed. I'm calling. Oh, you don't. I'm calling. Is that your high call? Oh, watch it. Oh, delicious. That's high. Actually, that high. I could probably do something else with it. But it shows if I just hide that. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, put your local in there. I was instancing, you see, so... <laughs> oh, oh. Let's do this. Just save this copy. Yeah. Right, and then... Fuck. Started painting this again. Oh yeah. So I can actually. Your beautiful little shop front. Oh my god, it's died on me again. Man, for some reason my PC in uh, labs just can't do Marmoset. It just. I feel like it's one of the less. It intensive, crashes when I share screen. Less intensive software, and it just can't handle it. <laughs> oh yeah. Basically painted everything again. Because why not? Yeah, why not? Oh. Okay, here we go. Here's my two... Oh, my two we can, right, okay, we so I haven't done smoothing groups or anything. But you get like an idea of the difference with chatting in topology and uh -huh. how chamfered it is. Yeah. Like, this is basic... Just got like an ingroove here or something, but on my high poly, I'm I want this like ribbed sort of I don't know rubbery thing. So I'll, mm. it's all it's all rounded. Well, it could be more. You can see the, kind of like the poly counts that we're thinking of when yeah. we're working in high high poly. And then when I bake that to this, it will it'll still keep that effect without spending the unnecessary amount of tries required to make it. Uh, same with like really good example is the lenses. And stuff, so it's quite blocky here, and then here it's very smooth and rounded. These camera lenses and stuff, and you get that. And when you bake it over, it will make those look nice and rounded out. And this goes hand in hand with yeah. the normals, of course, because you can see on like this at the moment, with these uh, the smoothing groups do help with these stuff, mm -hmm. this stuff as well. But it's always better to have like this nice, lovely, jubbly bake. Involved. And you can see a nice example of, well, maybe not actually. I thought that would turn out better, but I guess not. Um, rounded out sort of on the on the feet here. There's like a rounded edge mm. to it all. Whereas on this, yeah, so even though those are like hard surface, hard. So yeah, this like rounded this. edge will make a nice little impact on it. Make it look, make it look nice and juicy. Yeah. Thick. Mm -hmm. And when I show wireframes, you can really see it. Really see the difference, what we're talking about. I mean, like, this is what? 59, 60,000. This is 2,000 tries. So you, this is a large difference. And this could be higher poly, and it's lots yeah, of. 60,000 isn't even. It's not even that high. Yeah. yeah. That's, a, that's a pretty good. But I could take this into, I don't know, ZBrush or something there, and yeah. make some changes, and make some scratches. Really you could start doing uh, more of Chris's workflows, start getting all the scratches, dents, really bring it to life. I think about these things. And then ruin it at the end. Ruin it. Thank you, got some cheese. With the unwrap and the bake and the low poly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, those are all stages that you just got to spend time on. You just... Yeah. Huh? That's why you don't rush them. Yeah. yeah. Where it yeah, looked like what I just did. Yeah, I can finally. I'm finally gonna look at yours, Chris. Oh wait, that's me. Chris. You can't close it. Ah, uh, is it crashed? All right. Well, I'm the only one showing anything. Then there we go. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'll put a. Uh, let's have a look. Nice.
plane in. Keep that gray. Super wide. Bring it up. Put in a little sunlight. <laughs> Put in a little skylight. Use those cast shadows. shadows. Even working? Maybe not. <laughs> oh boy. There we go. Ambient occlusion. Oh, mama. Really bad. Mama. What are you gonna do about it? Huh? Gonna Nothing. <laughs> What are you gonna do? Nothing about this shit. We, uh, they look really Star Wars. Call it quits. Yes, call it quits. Call it quits. Yes, call it quits. A... Call it the song. Call it quits. Goodbye. Get good. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. See you next week. See you next time.